As we look ahead to 2025, Sony is once again poised to push the boundaries of camera technology even more. With cutting-edge features and groundbreaking innovations, Sony's 2025 camera models promise something for everyone, whether you're a seasoned professional or an enthusiastic hobbyist. Let's dive into the rumored features and specifications of Sony's most anticipated cameras for the upcoming 2025. The Sony A7S series has long been the industry standard for low-light performance and outstanding video capabilities. The upcoming A7S IV is expected to continue this legacy with some groundbreaking upgrades. At the core of the A7S IV could be a new sensor design, possibly retaining a resolution of around 12 megapixels, a deliberate choice to maintain exceptional low-light sensitivity. The rumored introduction of a dual-layer stacked sensor could significantly enhance the camera's ability to gather light, resulting in better performance in dim conditions. For filmmakers, the A7S IV might offer 6K recording at up to 120 FPS, along with oversampled 4K output for even greater detail and clarity. The inclusion of advanced codecs and higher bit depth recording may provide more flexibility in post-production, making the A7S IV an ideal tool for professional videographers. On the design side, the A7S IV might see refinements aimed at improving heat dissipation for longer recording sessions. In-body image stabilization is also expected to improve, which could be a huge benefit for handheld video work. Some reports suggest a release in late 2024, but many are eyeing a 2025 launch. Either way, the A7S IV is shaping up to be a must-have for low-light videographers. Next up, the Sony A6900 is shaping up to be a game-changer in the APS-C market. Rumors suggest that this model will feature a significant leap in resolution, boasting a 40.2 megapixel Exmor R CMOS sensor, a substantial increase from the 24 megapixel sensors found in previous models. This increase in megapixels could provide photographers with enhanced flexibility for cropping and producing larger prints, all while maintaining exceptional image quality. The boost in resolution might make the A6900 a go-to camera for landscape, portrait, and commercial photographers who demand detail and precision. One of the most exciting rumors surrounding the A6900 is its autofocus system. With 759 phase detection AF points and adjustable focus point sizes, this camera is expected to offer unprecedented accuracy in subject tracking. Video capabilities are expected to see a significant upgrade as well. Rumors suggest that the A6900 will support 8K recording at 30 frames per second and 4K at 120 FPS, making it competitive with some of the most capable hybrid cameras on the market today. Filmmakers and content creators might find additional features like breathing compensation and enhanced stabilization modes particularly useful, making the A6900 an appealing choice for video work. Though the release date remains uncertain, Many believe a late 2025 launch is possible. The original Sony A1 set a new standard for professional mirrorless cameras, and the A12 is expected to push those boundaries even further. While the A12 might retain the same 50 megapixel resolution as its predecessor, the real advancements are rumored to come in terms of speed and processing power. Faster readout speeds could allow for an increase in continuous shooting, potentially reaching up to 60 FPS with full AF-AE tracking, making it one of the fastest cameras on the market. On the video front, the A12 is rumored to support 8K recording at 60 FPS, a marked improvement over the original A1. Additionally, the camera might feature 4K recording at frame rates as high as 240 FPS for extreme slow motion capture. Improved heat management is also expected, addressing one of the few limitations of the original A1, allowing for extended recording times without the risk of overheating. Autofocus capabilities are also expected to see significant refinements with enhanced AI-driven subject recognition and tracking. This could make the A12 more adept at capturing fast-moving subjects across a wide range of photography genres, from wildlife to sports. Though its release date remains unclear, early 2025 is a strong possibility. For professional photographers and videographers, the A12 is expected to be a no-compromise tool, offering cutting-edge features across the board. 
The Sony A7 series has always been known as the backbone of Sony's full-frame mirrorless lineup, offering a balance between high-end features and affordability. The A7V is rumored to feature a new 44-megapixel sensor, striking a balance between the high resolution of the A7R series and the more modest pixel counts of previous A7 models. In terms of video capabilities, the A7V might offer 4K recording at up to 120 FPS, along with the possibility of 8K recording at more modest frame rates. Hybrid shooters could benefit from improved in-body stabilization and features like breathing compensation, making the A7V a versatile option for both stills and video work. Autofocus performance is expected to see an upgrade as well, with an AI-based system that enhances subject recognition and tracking across a variety of scenarios. The rumored inclusion of a new 4-axis multi-angle LCD screen could provide greater flexibility for composing shots, particularly in challenging shooting positions. Early 2025 is when most sources expect this model to hit the market. Building on the success of the original FX9, the FX9 II is expected to represent a major leap forward in Sony's cinema camera lineup. At the heart of the FX9 II could be a new full-frame sensor with a pixel size of 8.7 mm, potentially offering exceptional low-light performance and dynamic range. The FX9 II is rumored to support 8K recording at 60fps and 4K at up to 120fps with internal RAW recording capabilities, providing filmmakers with unmatched flexibility in post-production. The FX9-2's autofocus system is also expected to see significant improvements, building on Sony's already impressive Fast Hybrid AF system. Enhanced subject tracking and recognition could make the FX9-5 a versatile tool for everything from feature films to documentaries and run-and-gun shooting. With a potential release in late 2025, the FX9-2 is shaping up to be a versatile and powerful tool for both indie and high-end film productions. The A7R series has long been Sony's high-resolution champion, and the A7R6 looks set to raise the bar even higher. Rumored to feature a groundbreaking 100-megapixel sensor, this camera could offer unparalleled detail capture, making it a top choice for landscape, studio, and commercial photographers who require the utmost in image quality. Despite the high resolution, the A7R6 might offer continuous shooting speeds of up to 20 FPS with full AF-AE tracking. Video capabilities are also expected to improve, with 8K recording at up to 30 FPS and advanced video features like S-Log profiles and 10-bit internal recording. Other potential features include enhanced in-body image stabilization, dual CFX Press Type B card slots, and improved autofocus systems. The A7R6 is expected to be announced in mid-2025, offering a new benchmark in high-resolution mirrorless photography. The Sony FX50 is rumored to bring high-end cinema camera features to a more accessible price point. With a full-frame sensor offering at least 15 stops of dynamic range, this model could rival the performance of much more expensive cinema cameras. Supporting 4K at up to 120 FPS and potentially 8K at standard frame rates, the FX50 could be a versatile tool for filmmakers looking for high-quality video in a more compact and affordable package. With expected features like dual-base ISO and internal 10-bit recording, the FX50 may appeal to indie filmmakers, documentarians, and content creators alike. Its potential release in early 2025 makes it one of the most anticipated cinema cameras for the new year. Sony's 2225 camera lineup promises to push the envelope in every direction, from high-resolution sensors and enhanced video capabilities to AI-driven autofocus systems. So, which one are you waiting the most for? Share with us in the comments below. Thanks for watching.